The journey of your child's vaccine. A vaccine must be safe and effective. How a new vaccine is developed, approved, and manufactured. Vaccines begin the journey in the laboratory where scientists work to figure out how best to protect against dangerous germs. Before a new vaccine is made available to the public, researchers usually must do years of lab tests on the vaccine. If lab results look promising and the vaccine appears to be both safe and effective, volunteers will be enrolled to get the vaccines in a series of carefully monitored clinical trials. The manufacturer usually conducts three phases of clinical trials. Each phase is designed to gather more information about the vaccine's safety and how well it works. These trials can take years to complete. During phase one, about 20 to 100 healthy adults get the vaccine. Researchers track how well the vaccine works, whether it's safe, what is the correct dose for disease protection, and what possible serious side effects may occur. In phase two, hundreds of volunteers participate. This is when experts learn more about the possible short-term side effects and how the volunteers' immune systems are responding. Phase three trials are the most informative with results from hundreds or even thousands of volunteers. In these trials, vaccinated volunteers are compared with volunteers who receive another vaccine or no vaccine. These results give researchers a better idea of how well the vaccine works and if there are possible side effects they should expect. The Food and Drug Administration, or FDA, along with the Vaccines and Related Biological Products Advisory Committee, review all of the data the researchers have gathered throughout the trials and decide whether or not to license the vaccine. Once licensed, vaccines are made in batches called lots. Manufacturers test the lots to make sure the vaccines are safe, pure, and potent the FDA reviews the safety and quality of each lot before it is released. The FDA inspects manufacturing facilities on a regular basis to ensure quality and safety. How a vaccine is added to the U.S. recommended immunization schedule. Once the FDA licenses a vaccine, CDC brings together the members of the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices, or ACIP, to review all of the research available on the licensed vaccine. The members of the ACIP include world-renowned vaccine and disease experts from groups like the American Academy of Pediatrics and the American Academy of Family Physicians, CDC, and other government agencies. These experts look at how well the vaccine works and whether it's safe when given to different age groups. They also weigh the seriousness of the disease the vaccine prevents and figure out how many children would get sick if they did not get vaccinated. The experts then decide if they should recommend that vaccine be added to the U.S. recommended immunization schedule. If the CDC approves the experts' recommendations, the vaccine officially becomes part of the schedule, and soon it will be available at your healthcare provider's office. How a vaccine's safety continues to be monitored. Once children start getting the vaccine, the FDA and CDC continue to watch for possible side effects. Reactions that happen after a vaccination get reported to the Vaccine Adverse Events Reporting System, or VAERS. Anyone can submit a report to VAERS, including parents, caregivers, patients, doctors, and nurses. However, the reactions that are reported may or may not be caused by the vaccines. They may require further investigation. Researchers at FDA and CDC analyze the VAERS reports and look for any trends that may be happening. FDA and CDC also use other vaccine safety systems, the Vaccine Safety Data Link, or VSD, and the Post-Licensure Rapid Immunization Safety Monitoring System, or PRISM, actively monitor new vaccines to obtain additional information about their safety. VSD has access to healthcare information for over 24 million people. PRISM can analyze healthcare information from over 190 million people. CDC also uses the Clinical Immunization Safety Assessment Project, or CISA, to study vaccine safety. CISA is a collaboration between CDC and seven medical research centers. CISA vaccine safety experts conduct individual case reviews and clinical research studies about vaccine safety. 
Recommendations for using the vaccine may change if the vaccine's risks are found to be greater than its benefits. The end goal is always the same, to safely and effectively protect children, families, and communities against potentially serious diseases. For more information, please visit cdc.gov slash vaccines or cdc.gov slash vaccine safety or fda.gov slash cber.